and a pleasant good Tuesday morning. It's the uh, 20th of September here. And yes, we have a day-night doubleheader between the Dodgers and Diamondbacks. And I just saw that Julio Rodriguez is dealing with back discomfort, so they're just giving him a few days off. And uh, meanwhile, the Dodgers have a day-night doubleheader. The Angels have a uh, play the Rangers in Texas. And yeah, with the Angels already being eliminated from the postseason, something has to be done for the Halos. But the Dodgers have gotten the, well, they haven't officially got the job done yet. I mean, winning the division was step one. And then you got to win the division series. And with the wild card series being extended, um, yeah, I think the NL East is going to go down to the wire. And yes, I think the Braves and Mets have one more meeting against each other, and that will likely decide the division title, I think. And also, the Cardinals are in San Diego tonight as well, as Albert Pujols continues his pursuit of 700 homers. He's at 698 right now. He just needs two more. And yes, I, I think the Padres-Cardinals games are going to be sold out too. And um, yeah, the Padres are still trying to clinch a wild card spot. Meanwhile, like I said, the Mets already clinched a playoff berth last night. And of course, with the Astros winning the American League West. Um, it's always teams from Texas that have dominated the AL West the past few years. I mean, after the Angels, well, the A's also won the American League West in 2020 in that COVID shortened season. But I, I think in the full seasons we had 162 games. It's a marathon. Well, well, happy belated birthday to Trey Young. Also, a happy birthday to Ian Desmond and to Jason Bay. And a happy birthday to the late Red Arbach. And also, a happy birthday to the late Peter Ivers as well and um, well it was in the upper 70s yesterday across town so the weather's been pretty nice on these last few days of summer and we're gonna have more of the same today yes enjoy this nice weather now because this weekend it's we're gonna get those Santa Ana's back and it's gonna heat up well so it's not gonna be as bad as it was like a couple weeks ago when we had high humidity and triple digits, you know. And also, um, yeah, well, week three begins on Thursday night for football. And yeah, these, with just over two weeks to go in the season, anything can happen. As it stands today, the Dodgers already clinched a bye. Um, either the Mets or the Braves will also clinch a bye. Well, the Mets or the Braves will likely be a, a, a wild card team as well. With, with the right to host the Padres the way it's looking. And the Cardinals will likely host the Phillies. That's a National League playoff picture. American League, the Astros will likely be the one seed. The Yankees will likely be the two seed. They'll probably get a bye. And uh, I think the it's likely going to be the Cleveland Guardians that are going to win the AL Central. They'll likely be the three seed, like the Cardinals in the NL. And the... Jays and Rays are in the four fives respectively, while the Mariners will likely be the sixth seed. Um, 
But yes, the Angels are missing out already for the eighth year in a row. Yes, during this 10-year run where the Dodgers have made the playoffs, the Angels only made it once. Meanwhile, have a good rest of your Taco Tuesday. Let's sweep this day-night doubleheader. Amen.